How's it going? No, I don't think this is good, man. I'm just falling asleep. It's, I, I, it's not just a headache. I'm also like... My eyes are falling, like, like shutting down. Like I'm falling asleep as I'm walking and I feel like a little bit dizzy. How high are we? Like five, seven almost? Well, in that case, there's only one thing to do. Let's go down. You should go up. No, I shouldn't. Yeah, go on a solo mission. No, I'm not going. <laughs> if I look at the, the mountain ahead of us, I wouldn't want to be alone on terrain like this. And I don't <laughs> exactly know what's uh, above here. It's a hama right there. <laughs> Ice mountain in Bolivia. It's beautiful. This altitude stuff, man, it's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> it sure is. It's also something that we have to listen to. I guess so. I think it's time for the hot springs. Fuck. Yeah. Time for the spa. <laughs> Sonríes para mí, me sigues enamorando y mis ojitos dicen que sí. Por dentro me voy quemando. Si tú sonríes para mí, me sigues enamorando y mis ojitos dicen que sí. Por dentro me voy quemando. Me suelto el pelo para bailar. Moviendo las caderas y ya voy cantando Mirando aquí y mirando allá A ritmo de tambora me voy enamorando Me suelto el pelo para bailar Moviendo las caderas y ya voy cantando Mirando aquí y mirando allá A ritmo de tambora me voy enamorando It's our base camp right there somewhere Down by the lake this is a river that's coming from the glacier and we need to go all the way around and up there. What's happening? It's not going so well. We're not so good? No. Just getting sick, not good. No. I'm hungry but I don't want to eat. It's like... Just the thought of eating, it's like... Ugh. Makes me want to vomit, but I'm actually really hungry, so I don't know. We're supposed to be here for two weeks, disconnected from the outside world, and you know, if people are not feeling great. We shouldn't, we shouldn't, we shouldn't continue. Okay. I can pick you up tomorrow. Yeah. At two and move to Kiara, but there's no available guide for the trek. Maybe you can do it on your own and or try to find a guide in Kiara. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I'm waiting for your answer. I'll be there tomorrow between one and two. Perfect. Be ready to leave immediately. Perfect. Day two in the mountains. <laughs> I think we're all struggling at the moment. Woke up this morning, or actually last night. And well, basically puked out everything I had and some more. Mirte is really not feeling well. And of course, a little disappointed that we're gonna go back to probably La Paz or Chiara tomorrow. So this will be uh, well, one of the last days in uh, the Apalabamba, depending on if we're going into the jungle or not tomorrow. So yeah. Struggling a little bit, but it's an easy decision. It's basically the only decision that we can make. And I must say, it is a beautiful place. I had a chicken, no eggs, but she laid. I had a chicken, no eggs, but she laid. But then that rooster, he walked into the yard and he caught that chicken. Right of her guard She's laying eggs now Just like she used to Ever since that rooster 
Walked into the yard Archie's laying eggs now Just like she used to Ever since that rooster Walked into the yard Okay guys, guys. Cheers time. Down days To the max Donut time Hey Rance What do you think about this jungle track? Uh, it's looking really jungly. <laughs> <laughs> Well, congratulations, she just uh, summited Mont Blanc. How does it feel? <laughs> uh, Steph, what do you think about this? I love this kind of jungle trekking. <laughs> Finished, we made it to Chayapampa. Yeah, we started at 4,800 meters, we descended 2,000. Hey. All right, so we made it to the end of the second day. Good thing is, they even have some beer for us. Aquí está el guía. El Super Mario. San Francisco. Mountains. What a place to be. Alright, made it to base camp. That's Rance and Stefan's tent. That's my tent and there's a whole bunch of people here. And tomorrow we're going up there. Pequeño Alpamayo. Finally in the mountains. Feels pretty good. <laughs> what up, amigo? Yeah, I think it's uh, it's a sad thing that we had to replace Mirta because felt the sickness, but I think we found the perfect uh, stand-in. Mirta went home, but we got a replacement number four. <laughs> <laughs> so, Donkey, we are uh, planning to uh, climb uh, the Kenya Alpamaya tomorrow. What do you think? Yeah, that's what I thought. So, good morning everybody. We just passed the 5,000 meter mark for the first time. Greg is behind me, taking it nice and slow. And it's absolutely beautiful over here. We're at 5,100 something. Approaching Tarija, right there, and then off to Alpamayo Pequeño. How's it going? Pretty good. Kapitein's logbook, sterrendatum, geen idee. Een uurtje hiken kwamen we dicht bij de voet van de gletsjer, maar ik voelde me gewoon zo crap. Ik zag het gewoon niet gebeuren dat ik überhaupt naar boven zou komen, laat staan. Of het alleen naar beneden zou rijden. In de verte zie ik twee kleine stipjes verder lopen. Ik hoop echt dat de boys het gaan halen. Vandaag zat het er voor mij niet in. En morgen weer een dag. Over en sluiten. Om 
almost 5-4. So what we gotta do, little down climb right there, and then climb the ridge. Then hopefully ski this, but it's, a, it's looking a bit icy, so. And we have a little spicy descent uh, ahead of us because the snow is not in the best condition. Pretty exposed. Let's see the front side of the snow test. Yeah, I can also see it. Alright, cool man. You got the honors. How's it feel? It feels like I'm going to die, man. Whoa! Okay, Greg! Even at deze kant! Alright! Zeker? Ja. Je had op geen betere plek kunnen vallen. Ja, I know. Het is lager, maar... Not bad, huh? Getting acclimatized. Second day. Looking forward to the next project. And our base camp right there. I don't know if you can see it. Wow. Bolivia, man. What a place. I 
thousand five hundred twenty something. Ah, check out this sunrise. Woo. We made it to uh, the bottom of the boot pack. Still quite a bit up. It's the hardest thing I've ever done. Lorenzimo, hoe voel je je? Afgetijgerd. Afgetijgerd. Kind het nou? Voldaan en gelukkig. <laughs> maar als het op eten aankomt, behoorlijk nukkig. <laughs> Let's, uh, let's call it a day or a morning. And, uh, let's call it a, a two hours. Yeah, exactly. Let's head down. Uh, I, I, I'm not supposed to be feeling like this, you know? Like, it's the third mission. This is what we should be like acclimatized and feeling well and strong, and it's the opposite. Hmm. This altitude stuff, man, it's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> it sure is. It's also something that we have to listen to. I guess so. For the hot springs. Fuck. Yeah. Time for the spa. 
Cumbita de rockerón, ¿a qué te estás antojando? Cumbita de rockerón, no pongas cara. 